Hello, hello, hello! What's up tonight, everyone? Welcome, welcome, welcome. I am super excited. We finally get to play Ether Evil, and oh man, this set is so awesome. I hadn't been this excited to brew with a set in a long time, maybe forever. And now that it's on Magic Online and I'm actually getting to brew with it, it is even better than I imagined. So uh, let's do a couple more reminders. If you're looking for old streams, make sure to check out the Replay YouTube channel. Subscribe to that so you can catch up on all the old streams. And last but not least, if you're looking for another way to support the stream and the site, make sure to check out the merch page where we got tokens and t-shirts and playmats, new stuff being added all the time. We got the Ancestral Fission playmat in featuring uh, scoops in Ancestral Vision form or Ancestral recall form so make sure to check that out uh, anyway let's talk about this deck so tonight we are trying this crazy four color revolt deck it's got all the revolt cards and the basic idea is and this idea is sweet whether it works or not i'm not sure we have a ton of revolt enablers at one mana unbridled growth we play it on a land sack it draw a card on turn two trigger revolt uh renegade map play it on turn one sack it get a land on turn two trigger revolt terrarion same way so we're all in on triggering revolt on turn two and then our hope is to play multiple hidden herbalists and then follow that up with maybe a green wheel liberator to as a 4-3 and just go on the beatdown plan. So this is the plan. This is what we're going with. We'll see if it actually works. All right, so I think we're just going to renegade rallier here. Our opponent's only got one creature. It's not going to kill us. So let's just rallier. Next turn, we can do other things. Rallier can get back unbridled growth to draw another card. Kombu. Anguished Unmaking. Sure, opponent's down to 15. So we will get back Unbridled Growth. Put it on a forest. And then we can just, like, combo off. <laughs> yeah, this does look like the Nut Limited deck. <laughs> Bone has Scrap Heap Scrounger. Not especially scary. We have Wombo Combo set up. Opponent gets in for four. Sure. All right, what do we draw? Evolving Wilds. Well, let's sack Unbridled Growth. <laughs> More essence flux. Play a land. Um. All right, let's just attack with both. Hit our opponent. Pass the turn. Pacifist flips. Opponent's down to ten, so we're getting pretty close. So opponent goes to combat. Attacks. Leaves back the scrounger. All right, so crack evolving wilds. Essence Flux, Renegade Rallier. Get back a Unbridled Growth. <laughs> oh, so good. We will equip it to our land. That gives us another blue source. Now we block this thing. And Essence Flux, our Renegade Rallier. <laughs> Get back an Unbridled Growth. <laughs> Oh, put it on a land. Yeah, I don't know why they didn't attack with Scrap Heap Scrounger. That was, that was an odd choice. So this thing flips because we cast a million spells. Blooming Marsh, not great. Well, crack this. Ooh, another Renegade Rallier. Okay. Uh, white, green, and white. Cast Renegade Rallier. Get back. Unbridled Growth. Put Unbridled Growth on our Swamp. Uh, we better leave. We better just get in for three. Get in for three. All right, opponent's going to make a 1-1. One, one. I think we're kind of actually getting here. So opponent makes a 1-1. One, one. Is this for chump blocking? Opponent jumps. Yup. Now play Blooming Marsh. Pass the turn. <laughs> we still got an Essence Flux to keep comboing off. Oh, uh, it does. It is way more fun than I imagined. Oh, that's big. That could be deadly at some point. We don't really have a flyer or removal. Tamio would be nice. Well, let's see what our opponent does. Goes attacking. So, block pacifist. Essence flux. Get back. Terrarion. We are out of essence flux. Opponent passes. Come on, good draws. That's a land. So let's start by sacking Unbridled Growth to draw a card. Sylvan Advocate. 
And let's sack Unbridled Growth. Draw a something good. <laughs> Another Rallier. We still have to make sure we don't lose to Heart of Kirin, which is not guaranteed at the moment. So one, two, let's sack Terrarion, add green white. That's a Plains. Okay, so Renegade Rallier. Get back on Bridal Growth. Yep. We will put it on our island, I guess. Play a Sylvan Advocate. Play a Plains. Play Oath of Ajani. Pump up the team. Do some attacking. Oh, this is so close. Yeah, our opponent can block with Heart of Curate, but we can attack with our two Renegade Ralliers and put our opponent to one or make them trade in their Heart of Curate. All right, so if they can't pump up Heart of Kirin, we should be able to win next turn. If they can pump it up, we're in trouble. We're dead to like a Nissa, but we're not dead on board because Heart of Kirin's only four and we're at five. And we can block anything else our opponent attacks with. There's Heart of Kirin. Opponent goes attacking. Well, let's block. What? What is happening? All right, Archangel Avison. I think we still win though. We dropped a one. Swing with everything. Whoo! Uh, that was pretty awesome. And our opponent scoops it up. <laughs> uh, that was a lot more fun than I would have imagined. There's a wandering fumeral for our opponent. Well, Sanctum, and let's just lead on Renegade map. Pest turn. I don't know what our answers are to Sahili Rai combo in the main deck. Island for our opponent. Well, Blooming Marsh, Unbridled Growth, and Pest Turn. Opponent anticipates, so this looks like Jeskai Control, Jeskai Sahili, something like that. Opponent did find their land. Well, we get to start generating some Renegade Rallyer value. So sacrifice Unbridled Growth, draw yourself a spirit, play a Plains, Renegade Rallyer, Get back, Unbridled Growth. Combo. <laughs> it's a combo. And see what our opponent can do. We finally drew a Selfless Spirit, which should be pretty good in a control matchup. Sanctum. All right, so I think what we got to do here is crack the map, get a Plains. I think we just got to kill Sahili. So get a Plains, play the Plains, play Selfless Spirit, play... Oath of Ajani. Pumps up the Rallier enough that we can just take out Sahili. And now at least we're not in danger of just dying next turn randomly. Uh, that's awkward. Well, let's attack with everything. Emulating Glare. Well, let's, let's, uh, let's sack on Bridal Girl, see what we draw. Renegade Map. I'm starting to have my doubts about this deck. Uh, play a Vengeful Rebel. Whoa, that's not what I was trying to do. Play a Vengeful Rebel. Sanctum and go. This deck needs a Woodland Wanderer. Woodland Wanderer could be pretty sweet. There's the Felidare Guardian for our opponent. Yikes. Yeah, gets another energy. So they are Sahili away from winning, and we don't really have an answer. Sylvan Advocate. Well, attack with everything. I guess they don't know that we don't have an answer, so we just, like, hope that they maybe don't go for it. Play a Sylvan Advocate. Play a Sagdom. Yeah, this is a list from a very small Japanese tournament. So it it performed well, but the tournament was very small. So, all right. Good game. I thought it looked cool, and it's worth, uh, worth talking about because of that. But as far as how great it is, hard to say... Just because the tournament size is so small. Well, if we ultimate Tamiyo, all our pain will be worth it. If our opponent disallows our ultimate of Tamiyo, I'm going to scoop the rest of the batch. <laughs> so we will see. We will see. It's all depending on this Tamiyo ultimate. Pass the turn. Come on, one time. No disallow. No anything to do. Oh, come on. Come on, deck. Once. Oh, I will I will finish this stream happy if we ultimate Damio here. I don't even care that the rest of it has been a disaster. We're still drawing lands. All right. Yes! It happened! It happened! 
we're winners. We're winners. So, trigger. Now let's see if we can, like, combo off somehow. I don't think we can, but it would be sweet. Get another planes out of our deck. Hey, we get to cast our Renegade Ralliers for free. Watch out, opponent. You are in trouble now. Uh, so we'll cast Renegade Rallier. <laughs> the funniest thing is... <laughs> And this probably says the most about our deck, is we just ultimate at Tamiyo, and I'm still not sure that it matters. <laughs> we ultimate at Tamiyo, we get to play, we get to play a 3-2 and get back a Terrarion. We got him. <laughs> we got him. I don't think, is our opponent even scared about our deck with the Tamiyo emblem out? <laughs> I am not sure. They might not be. Ooh, Hidden Herbalist is going to gain us mana? Well, sack Terrarion. Add some useless mana, since we don't need mana. What do we need mana for? Ooh, okay. Man, I wish we had something that just drew us a card. Well, cast Hidden Herbless gains us some mana that we don't need, because we can cast everything for free. Uh, cast Renegade Rallier. Get back a Terrarion for next turn. <laughs> that we can... <sighs> that we can sack. Then let's plus Tamio on our Renegade Rallier and our Hidden Herbalist, just in case. Get in, draw a card. We're doing it! We're doing it! <laughs> Bone has Torrential Gear Hulk for Unlicensed Disintegration. Well, let's blink our Renegade Rallier. Gotcha, it's free. <laughs> get back a. Well, I guess we better get Selfless Spirit now. It should also give everything flash. This emblem isn't that good, actually. We need to we need to have flash too. Ah, another land. <laughs> Even with the emblem, it's still horrible. Vengeful Rebel, Blooming Marsh. So how many how many lands? One in our graveyard. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fourteen. 14 of our 20, and we're not even halfway through of our deck yet. <laughs> oh, this deck. When it anticipates, anticipates. <laughs> yeah, I don't know about the blocking there. At least we get to hopefully draw with Tamio here. Ooh, Essence Flux. Well, Hidden Herbalist, Vengeful Rebel, go attacking with everything. Draw some cards that we can cast for free. Uh, deck is relatively fun when it's working well. Also, relatively horrible. But it is fun when it works. And I, I'm still interested in trying more with this archetype. I've talked about this before. Like, I try to take something away from every deck I play, even if the deck is absolutely horrible. So, with this deck, I think that the takeaway is you could do some really cool things with Renegade Rallier. Renegade Rallier was a really impressive card. So, I think that that card has potential to be built around. So, I did like that. Cards that didn't impress me were Hidden Herbalist, seemed absolutely horrible, unplayably just very bad and green wheel liberator was much less consistent than i thought so oh well everyone i think that wraps it up for tonight so thanks for hanging out thanks for all the subs sorry you didn't win more hopefully it was still fun i still had fun playing it even though our record wasn't ideal but anyway have a great couple days everyone check out the site in between and i will talk to you soon